Episode 3, Fractured Mask. As the pressure to uncover the impending attack on Gotham intensifies, Bruce navigates his dual identity and his relationship with his new allies. Allies. I wear the mask in order to protect this city. But when faced with a new breed of criminals calling themselves the Pact, the direct approach was met with disaster. I had to don a different mask. As Bruce Wayne, I infiltrated their ranks. The plan was to get in, set the trap, and get out. But the plan failed. Now they're one step closer to their goal. And all I have are questions. What is the pact really after? Why steal Riddler's body? Friend or foe? Nice place you got here. Did it come with the vermin? Or did you add that yourselves? This everyone? Riddler mentioned Harley. Oh yeah, whoops. Queen is otherwise occupied. Our crossing the river stinks. We are the entirety of our cabal at the moment. Oh, this gentleman was someone we picked up after Riddler's departure. Bruce Wayne. Bruce, was it? Charmed. Be gentle. This is Mr. Wayne's first foray into the field of felonry. We've actually crossed paths. How? I may have stolen a thing or two from Mr. Wayne. He has so much, I just didn't think he'd notice. Enough pleasantries. You have the device? Excellent. Harley said your gems were in her safe. If she fails to return, you can pester John. He knows the code. It's fine. We can start. Who are these oh, randoms? Get some... What are we doing? Well, we're going to extricate the body. Riddler built a secret back door into the security system of his old employer. I need to scan his eyes and then create a retinal key for them. Then I'll use the key to make goggles, and we can open whatever doors he could. Help me lift. This wasn't the original plan. He was supposed to be alive, but things change. Get his head in a good position. Oh, that's, that's disgusting. Dig the plates under his lids. Press the button and scan away. This reminds me of, uh, what is that? Tales from the Borderlands. Ugh, that's gross. There was a scene kind of like this. Oh my god. What the hell did they do to him? And what's with the refrigerator coffin? Why would the agency transport him like this? This doesn't add up, Bruce. Bruce, I'm sorry about Lucius. I'm guessing it wasn't a gas leak or whatever the news said. You're right. Riddler killed him. It was meant for me. Damn it, Bruce. I'm... This isn't all on you. On to the next. At least the eyes aren't falling out this time. I been looking into with this group, but I certainly didn't expect it to involve you. And I know you're no stranger to peril, but you shouldn't be here. So, what gives? 
Well, it shouldn't be that much of a shock. My father was a crime lord. Apples and trees and all. Glad to know you've grown more comfortable with lying since we last met. You're not the only one with questions. One question. Make it fast. How did you get involved with these psychopaths? Ran into Harley once or twice, but I knew Riddler. He tried to bring me in before... Well, before someone here probably killed him. <sighs> Have we concluded? Two eyes in the can. Excellent work. Then we can... She's back! Sorry I'm late. Traffic was murder. <laughs> I couldn't stand it. You were there, and, and I was here. I was on my way. Well, I was getting to get on my way. Look! I put on shoes. Oh, thanks, Puddin. You would have had a blast if you were with me. And how about this one? Did you miss me, sugar? Well, John was beside himself. Was? I'd say still is. So I got one question for you. If you missed me so much... Why the hell did you let them leave me behind? Since Big Bad Bean's plan almost got one of our most valuable members killed today, we're having a change in management. What the hell? So speak up if there are any objections. We can hash this out in a reasonable manner. Hurry! Damn, she's crazy. Oh, this one's actually got some brains. <laughs> Everyone else better be smart too. You ah <laughs> uh, uh, uh. You are a means to an end when this is over. Did it occur to any one of you people that the job we just pulled went sideways a little too quick? I think they knew we were coming because a little rat Hold him. They was right to beat up his guy before we left to hit the convoy. He just beat up the wrong one. Since he couldn't deliver, I'm taking over the case. And I'm not gonna let whoever it is stop me <laughs> from getting what I want. This leak, it almost got me killed. So now, no one moves, no one breathes without my say-so. Cause I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. And whoever it is, is gonna find their inside suddenly all fresco. That make you nervous, Bruce? What do you have to say? Hey, I'm on your side, Harley. There's no need for threats. It's not Wade! Excuse me, peanut gallery. You got something to say? Wayne pulled his own out there. Salt with my own two eyes. And I ain't gonna let a good effort go unnoticed. Then, let's get back to work! Damn, the random stood up for me. If anyone else has any issues with the New World Order, my door is always open. Hmm. <laughs> Lead us to our prize, and all will be forgiven. Wayne, come here a second. Who is this guy anyway? That was dangerous. Now you're on her radar. Hey, we chose a dangerous line of work. Hiya, Bruce. Guess you're clear. For now. Because apparently you're so capable. I got an errand for ya. I know just about everything about Riddler's plan. But he kept one card close to his chest. The location of the job. Took the secret to his grave. Now I got his laptop. But look at this. And keep your yap shut. 
Can't let any of these mooks sense weakness. It's encrypted! It's like he knew not to trust any of us. <laughs> Go figure. Okay, let me see the laptop. I'm pretty tech-savvy. Maybe I can crack Bruce, it. Bruce, in case you missed it, we have a mole problem. And until we clear that up, the keys to the kingdom stay with me. Got it? Riddler had a beef with his former employers, who are cooking up some very dangerous and super fun stuff at a black site lab somewhere here in Gotham. And what is it we're after, this super fun stuff? You ask a lot of questions, you know that? I've been able to piece together most of his plan, except where the black site is. You're She's gonna, gonna get cleaned off anytime soon? And when you do... Maybe you'll get a treat. Is that blood or a hair dye? Delicious little treats. You're asking me to do something with little or no information to go on. And when I asked you for some kind of clarification, you dodge. Bruce, did you see what just happened? I'm in charge here. That means when I ask you to bring me something, you deliver it. No Questions asked. See, I ain't letting this laptop out of my sight until I clear up this mole problem. So, I want you to head over to Riddler's place and do some digging. I might need some help. That place is full of death traps. Take John with you. Oh, Just don't geez. get him hurt. That's my job. Road trip? With Bruce? I'm Actually, in. I was thinking Catwoman. After all, she knew him. Mm, good point. Take a two. I'll grab some snacks. <laughs> What's that guy's story? Cat lady, are you more of a beef jerky or trumpet-shaped corn bites girl? Hey, be careful around him. He's smarter than he looks. That's good, because he looks... off. Who's ready to hit the road? Acid flower time? Who are you gonna tell if you see anything that ain't on the up and up? You, Harley. But don't worry, Bruce is my best friend. He'd never betray me. Oh, sweet, innocent pudding. Friends have the easiest access to stab you in the back. Now get out of here. I call shotgun. I want that black site location. He's looking more jokery now, I guess. So I'm assuming Joker killed what's his face? Riddler. Harley doesn't know. So Joker's trying to manipulate everyone. Probably. And he just acts like an idiot because that's what he does. It's most likely what's gonna happen. We'll see though. I can't believe this is where he decided to set up shop. Wasn't like him to slum it. I always thought the abandoned water tower was an odd choice. I mean, the mold risk alone. It's not the abode of a man who asked me to steal a Renoir, that's for sure. Catwoman, you need to find us a way in. My specialty. Come on, John. You're with me. Yes! Our first team up! Waller. Glad you answered. We need to talk. Listen about the convoy. We couldn't get to you safely. The EMP blast knocked out my ability to communicate with my field agents. Sorry. It obviously wasn't supposed to go down like that. Harley's crew is a threat, and they are moving fast. Towards what? Do you know what their end goal is yet? No. No one's talking. Bruce, you are the best chance of figuring out what that is. Well, now they have Riddler's body. It was cryogenically frozen. By the agency. Bruce, this was a 60-year-old man who went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Batman. I have some very interested researchers who wanted to see what kept him ticking. Wait, wait. Uh, I got the punchline wrong. Uh, let me start. It's fine, John. 
There's a black site. Some sort of research lab, I'm guessing. Whatever's there is what they're after. And Harley doesn't know the location. She asked me to find it. Stay put for now and maintain your cover at all costs. This is our chance to get ahead of this train. So I say, Doc, I'll have what she's having. <laughs> <laughs> the perimeter is boarded up, but it's nothing we can't get through. Lead the way. Just have to get through these boards. Don't worry. I brought my key. <laughs> you can do it, John. Hey, I believe in you, John. You show that wall who's boss. Hey, Bruce, I have an idea. Why don't you jimmy it open? Damn, that's no fun. I believed in him. That's the boring way. Who's there? Don't move. Wait a minute. I know you. You're Bruce Wayne. Uh, guilty is charged. Want to explain what you're doing out here? This isn't exactly the heights. Uh, this isn't what it looks like. It looks like you're trying to break into a crime scene. Uh, oh, oh, okay. Detective... Bullock. Detective Bullock, right. Uh, look, there's actually a very good reason for all of this. Stay right there, jerkwad. I'm calling this in. I've been asked to report any suspicious activity around here, and you're acting suspicious. Oh, come on now, detective. We can work this out, just the two of us. I disagree. Bruce freaking Wayne. Unbelievable. Wouldn't even be working tonight if I didn't need the extra dough. But maybe this will make me look good with the boss. You have dynamite in those fists, Bruce? <laughs> that okay, was that was wonderful. fun. Can we wake him up so Bruce can do that again? No, John. Let's go. He won't be out for long. Come on. Let's get moving. What could this title mean? Fractured Mask? Whose mask? Oh, geez, this puzzle. I remember this. It's even worse Trolled than I me. expected. The man I knew was flawed, but he could still muster a little warmth. Huh, sounds like you knew a very different Riddler than the one I met. I wish he'd never come back to Gotham. Me too. There's hope for everyone. I don't think any of us are beyond reach. <laughs> I know we've just met, but somehow I knew you'd say that. You knew him best. Where do you think he'd keep any info on what we're after? Well, not to state the obvious, but... It's probably behind a riddle or a puzzle somewhere. Oh, I call the downstairs bedroom. <laughs> Careful, John. This place is probably a death trap. Follow him, Bruce. I don't want John's curiosity to get us killed. I'm getting really tempted to touch something. <laughs> this choker laugh. Okay. I, I don't think this puzzle is going to trigger again, is it? This thing was horrible. How many TVs does one guy need? Probably afraid he'd miss something.
Oh, that's probably it then. Let's check that out last. This is where he built his boxes. <sighs> you gotta admire the ingenuity. It's a wonderful toy. It's a wonderful way to lose your hand. Well, you know what they say. Curiosity killed the cat. There's something under here. Some kind of platform. Handcart? Wonder what he was moving. Hey, Bruce. I've been wanting to talk to you. Alone. You have? I don't like how cozy Catwoman was with Riddler. Because he was a killer? Because he was rude to me. We need to stick together. I don't trust this kitten one bit. You know what they say about a black cat crossing your path. Don't worry, I can handle it. Oh, really? I'm Bruce Wayne. I deal with women like her all the time. Damn, that look in his eye. Oh, move to the death chamber. I have to move this thing? I mean, I guess there is something under it. But what is this then? That's odd. What do you have to say about all this? Nothing? Turn your back on me? Okay, fine. Can I go up? Oh, I can. Sure proud of his exploits, wasn't he? Hey, Catwoman. Hey, money man. So why are you really here? I said I'd tell you when we're alone. We're not. I'll tell you later. How'd you and Riddler first meet? You know I do a lot of... freelance work. Let me guess, Riddler wanted a painting from the Louvre? <laughs> Without bragging too much, it was an easy job. Huh. After all, I'd already robbed the place twice. He became a valuable contact when money was tight. I'm just curious if you... Yes? If you missed me. John is right downstairs. Yes or no? Answer the question. <sighs> Fine. Of course I did. But don't read any more into it than that. Yay. We can hook up. And before she dies, canned food. It'll be horrible. And lots of it. We can't all get lobster thermidor on a whim. Riddler's bed couldn't look less comfortable if he tried. It's like a prison bed. A pair of Riddler's shoes. He didn't exactly have great fashion sense. Why would I pick them up? What are they for? You're... you're taking his shoes? They might be useful. Okay. They're less expensive than what you usually wear. I don't think that's what he meant. Oh, there's multiple switches everywhere. Maybe I need to place the shoes. Oh, I guess not, because the shoes, both shoes were already on there. But you need to place, I think, three things to open up a door, probably? Maybe even just two things. That's pretty fun. I mean, the Riddler for this kind of game is pretty good, I think, as a villain.
So I don't have the option to place anything on it yet. Let's just do the hand part one then. Let me help you out there, Bruce. I don't want you to bend your cover bow. in the grave until the second inevitably follows. You have to work hard and sleep hard in order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. I see. Work hard, as in this. Because this is where he worked, and then sleep up there so you put the shoes there i guess stand on i don't think so can i touch it that'd be fun and i'm dead you have to work hard and sleep yeah in order to earn your way six feet under what did i tell you I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. Let me guess. If I touch this, I get zapped. <laughs> well, you're not ready to die just yet. Oh, wait. Yes, you are. <laughs> That's so troll. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, let's put the shoes on the switches. In order to earn your way six feet under. What did I tell you? I suppose those are our clues to whatever Riddler is hiding in here. But what if I stand on them? I want to try all these out now. Just because it's such a roll. Ah, ah, ah. To truly understand my mind, you must first walk a mile in my... Certainly, you know the rest. Be careful what you said on those. Damn, I don't get zapped. It's boring. This is my city. This is my plan. Nobody will interfere. <sighs> That sounds positive. What if I stand on this one? Ah, ah, ah. To truly understand my mind. Okay, okay, okay. You must first this. walk a mile in my... <laughs> Certainly, you know the rest. I'm worried we're running out of time here. Do we all get zapped? I take you by night. By day, take you back. None suffer to have me, but do from my lack. Wait, is that a puzzle too? I don't get that one. Your hair is really green. I've been meaning to ask you. The green hair, what what is what is that? 
I don't know what's with your black hair. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm a little sensitive about my style. Uh, didn't mean to make you uncomfortable. I don't remember anything about myself before Arkham, and when I came to... Well, here it was. I guess it's natural. John, we're friends, right? So I gotta ask, what do you see in Harley? A ruthlessness. The way her accent comes and goes when she's mad. The way she lets things escalate into violence. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you hate Riddler so much? I've mentioned this before, but uh, he always interrupted me. Never let me get to the punchline. It takes a lot of confidence to tell a joke, you know? Made me look like an idiot! In front of Harley, and those other guys. But hey, uh, I guess I have the last laugh now. <laughs> I should go. Okay, so if the last part wasn't a puzzle, I just press the switch. And then it sends me underground, six feet. Oh goody. It looks like you've got both feet in the grave. You hear that? It's like you're standing on an elevator. I bet whatever we're looking for is down there. Maybe someone should stay up here. Keep watch. Good point. Let's go, Bruce. Sorry, cat lady. Or maybe you could stay? Oh, no. Harley gave me an assignment, and I mean to fulfill it. We'll go first. Make sure it's safe. Bruce, you, you care about me that much? And here I thought I was losing you to her. I'll be on the next one, so, so don't die before I get there. <laughs> Some of these laughs are so good for this episode. Something. Charming and unnerving at the same time. So, now that we have a moment, care to fill me in? Care to tell me the real reason you're doing this? Out with it, Bruce. What's going on? I'm undercover. For yourself? <laughs> Isn't Bruce Wayne kind of always undercover? Or is it the other way around? No, yes, I'm undercover working with a group called the Agency. Partnered up with people, huh? Good to hear you've grown a bit. Sorry if I was a little rattled at the clubhouse back there. Wasn't quite ready to see her face again, but... You look good. Even with what looks like a piercing gone wrong. Not great or anything. But... Good. You know. You look great too. I didn't say great. I said good. Okay, duly noted. Now it's my turn. Why are you here? You're not really in bed with this... pact. And what if I am? Maybe I need the money. Maybe I don't. Who knows? The world's a complicated place. They're lunatics. They're dangerous. I'm dangerous too, Bruce. Or maybe you forgot that detail. You told me once I had more in me than just a thief. I can handle it without a babysitter. Can you two get a move on? Playing guard is getting pretty. Old. Just another minute. We've got it under control, John. Fine. We've got a job to do, remember? Let's just see what this is all about. can see us from up there. Shouldn't it be really suspicious that we're just talking? 
Didn't Riddler carry one of these in Europe? He did, but they were purely aesthetic. Aesthetic with a giant hook on the top. Giant metal hook. This might hold the black site location. Be something nearby we can use. Oh, it's not the cane. Hmm, interesting. Use the keyboard. That might get us killed. This has got to be something else. Filing cabinets, USB drive. Oh, USB drive. Maybe. I mean, there's got to be a password, right? It's One, two, three, four. Before. It's at least worth a try. Riddles. <laughs> A little on the nose, don't you think? One, two, three, four. Yeah, I think it might be a trap. Maybe, but we already made it past the line of security, so maybe not. Your certainty is assuring. USB drive. Here we go. Decryptor detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Project Lotus. Sanctus. Retinal scan required. Shit. I haven't made the goggles yet. Retinal scan. Time out. Hephaestus protocol enacted. The decryptor! You know what Sanctus is, don't you? I heard stories on jobs. Best I can piece together, they're a group up to... No good is generous. They're scary. Great. One thing's for sure. We're not getting any more info off that thing. Well, there's always Riddler's laptop. Harley still has it. The decryptor probably works with that as well. Everything okay down there? Send the lift back up. I should have come back sooner and reeled Riddler in, but I didn't. Knowing he was tangled up with Sanctus, and what he did to Lucius. This is my fault. My mess to clean up. By yourself? I can help. Why? Do I look like I need your help? You don't have the code to do what needs to be done here, Bruce. You want to do this your way? You'll have to beat me to it. doing balancing the scales you are not leaving here with that oh honey i'm already gone damn didn't expect that resourceful as always Bye, Bruce. It's been fun. <laughs> You've gotten rusty. You haven't gotten past me yet. Mm. 
I forgot how skilled you are with your hands. Kiss her? Are you serious? In front of him? That's one way to get her to notice you. Move, John. Damn, you're terrible. Stop her. Too. Ow. Catwoman, why? Sorry, Bruce, but I'm taking Harley's laptop for myself. And I'm finishing this my way. <clears throat> Harley's laptop, huh? You and I were going to talk somewhere else. Wait, where are we going? The entrance is on the top. Why do we go that way? <laughs> that was really random. Oh, that's the stuff. So, John, about the laptop. Um... You know, I'm the first guy who resort to stealing from anyone, anyone but her. But in a way, that almost makes it more enticing. But in another way, maybe I tell her, getting her good graces, maybe I will. And maybe I'll do just that. Then she remember my name has an H in it. She always spells it J O N. And how do you think Harley feels about snitches? She told me to snitch. I think she likes them. Well, maybe not. I don't know, Bruce. I'm torn here. Just thinking about her makes me feel like I'm floating. She's the most intriguing creature ever to grace me with a demeaning insult. Which is great, don't, don't get me wrong. I, I, I want more, Bruce. Like you and Catwoman. I'm only a little ashamed to say that dance had my pulse pounding. What's your relationship with her? Your real one? Catwoman and I are... what we have is a little tangled up. Oh, I wouldn't give to be that tangled up with Harley. <sighs> if only Harley saw me. Like, really saw me. The world's a crazy place, isn't it? I want Harley, and you want the laptop. Maybe we can come to an arrangement. I help you with Harley. <laughs> <laughs> I see. You're up to bat then, Wayne. What did you do to make Catwoman purr? How can I get that with Harley? How can I make her see me? Be yourself? That's not gonna help, is it? Or is it? I think she likes crazy, right? Pretty sure she likes crazy. You just need to be genuine. You're special, John. She just needs to see that. So, be myself. I hear that a lot, but how can I be myself if I don't really know who that is yet? How did you know who you are, Bruce? To be honest, I, I don't. No one does. People lie to themselves about their true nature. Uh, so maybe I'm lying to myself. That would explain something I've noticed recently. I can feel someone a few layers deep pacing like an animal in a cage. Just looking for something to start it. The prison break.
You seem mm. unusually quiet. Maybe whatever's inside is too much. Stick with being genuine for now. Got it. But how does that even work? Bond with her. Lend a hand with a problem she has. I don't know, Bruce. I have a tough time just talking to her. Oh, I've got an idea. Let's play pretend. Uh, what? You'll be Harley. <laughs> I don't say know about this one. Harley would say. Bane is a loser. Bane is such a loser. Oh, yeah? What are you gonna do to him? Snuff out his light. I don't know what she would say. <laughs> I'd kill for some front row seats to that. Okay, now say something uh, date-like. Like we're out painting the town red. Hi, John. I like hiking. Do you like the outdoors? Why don't you love me? <laughs> That's awkward. So, so what do you think? Pretty good, right? Okay, so you're coming off just a little bit desperate. And women like that. No, none. Okay, hit me. Another. What was your favorite thing about Arkham Puddin'? For me, it was Sloppy Joe Fridays. Bruce! This is just uncanny! Okay, okay, here we go. I enjoyed... the lights. They had a hum to them. Felt like a blanket. Fuzzy, even. I miss that on the outside. It, it doesn't feel as real here, you know? Out here... Chaos seems to rule the day. It's loud and uneven. But you, Harley, you thrive on it. I could learn from that because I thrive on you. You're my light outside of Arkham. Ah, that's so nice. That's beautiful, John. She'll be eating out of your hand in no time. Y you think? I, I don't know. It, it felt weird to say. I really think I'm getting the hang of this. I'll start the next one. Your face has all the adequate face-like qualities one looks for in the, in a face. Nice. Harley, I lobbed you a perfect pitch. You gonna swing or what? John, sorry, something just came up. Uh, it's business. I have to run. So soon? It's, it's fine. A for effort. I guess I won't go tattling to Harley. So, will you help me get the laptop? Gosh, Bruce. Our talk really got me fired up to find myself. My true self. Uh-oh. Plus, your Harley is spot on. Okay, that's creepy too. Oh, you drive a hard bargain, mister. Wait. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> okay, let me mull over the logistics. But I'm in. Meet me back at the subway when you're done with your business. And because we're pals, coffee's on my dime. It's gonna cost more than a dime. Bruce? Oh, he just leaves. Oh, no, he doesn't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. He knows. There are some versions of the versions of the Joker who actually know who Batman Jim. is. Nicotine patch. Happy now? But not the early yeah. ones. Don't I think. look so pleased with yourself. Oh, it's good you're here. The last time I fired this up, you didn't show. Had me concerned. What do you mean? The agency convoy? All those freaks were in one place, and you decide not to show? Well, I didn't like you. You don't take time off. Waller ordered me to stand down. You're kidding! The nerve on her! I guess I can't really talk. We got there late. And by then it was just Quinn. She still hospitalized a dozen good cops, and then gave us a slip. Is that all? Uh, no. No, I... 
I got a favor to ask. Lucius Fox. I know he was your friend, and I don't mean to speak ill of the dead. But I think he might have been up to some shady stuff before Riddler's attack on Wayne Tower. He might not have been the man you thought. Not entirely. Think carefully about your next words, Jim. I've been thinking about him since the moment I threw that switch. Riddler had it out for Lucius Fox, and I'm sure there's something more. The way you're pushing back on this only confirms that. Waller Was shut he involved down any with that into the Sanctus thing? His death. And that means something stinks in Denmark. They could follow that stench all the way to Fox's employer. Look, just how much do you really know about Bruce Wayne? He's another friend. You know, for a loner, you sure seem to have a lot of friends. You might want to start choosing them more carefully. At first, I thought Fox was at the center of it all. But there's a hell of a lot more. A Wayne Enterprises security guard comes to GCPD saying he was assaulted by Harley Quinn and her gang. Oh, this is and a who false was lead. Her around like a pet? Bruce Wayne. Then I checked the video recordings. Someone did an amateur job covering up the security footage. Files were replaced, time unaccounted for, sloppy. And strike three? One of my officers gets bashed in the head while he goes into Riddler's old workshop. Bruce Wayne is dirty and he's dangerous. Waller knows all of this happened too, and she refuses to let me move on it. So I need you to bring him in. That's the favor. I can't do it, but you can. I know what it looks like, Gordon, but Wayne isn't dirty. You're wrong, you know. His whole thing, it doesn't add up. Am I supposed to take off my mask now? Safety is slipping out from under me and I can't stand it! I know your friend Catwoman's in town. Got a rap sheet that to put her away for life. Maybe I can't move on Bruce Wayne, but I can move on her. I should have done this a year ago. Please, Jim. Don't. This is between you and me. I thought you were better than this, Batman. As soon as I get back to the office, I'm sending out a task force after her. And you. You better not tell her we're coming. Damn it. He sounds like he's on a warpath. If I warn Selina and she gets away, Gordon and the police will blame me. But if I don't, I put her in danger. Don't forget that you're both after that laptop. Gordon might be your best chance to slow her down. Unfortunately, we're running out of time. Damn it. Gordon has gone too far this time. I can't help but have sympathy for a man trying to do what is just. He feels as if Gotham is slipping out of control. And it is. You know, Miss Kyle is going to run sooner or later. It's her nature. How much can you really trust her as an ally? I know how you feel about her. Make certain you aren't letting that cloud your judgment. You know what must be done. It's done, Al. I hope Gordon doesn't take it personally. Uh, I'm afraid he will. Don't go, Gordon. I've got a city to save. <laughs> Please, Jim. You have to let me in. I can't, Batman. It's too much. I'm the best friend you have in spandex or whatever my suit is. You can trust me. It's, it's my mustache. What if I grew a mustache for you? Batman, hi, hello. 
So, uh, John. My name's John. John Doe. You don't know me. Well, we actually did cross paths once, but, uh... What did you overhear? I, I didn't hear anything. I just got here, I swear. Oh, this is just... What a pleasure. It's so nice to finally meet you. It's just a handshake. No. Uh-huh. Jeez, this is Arkham all over again. I'm just such a huge fan of yours. And here you are, in the flesh. <laughs> Looking for mentors, role models. I've come across a few good candidates. You're... you're Batman. <laughs> I don't take on students. Now hold on. Before you accept, here's what I bring to the table. I can get you Riddler's laptop. All his secrets right there. And the gang who attacked the convoy, they needed to pull on the big score. The point. So what if I steal it from Harley Quinn, no less, and give it to you? But, uh, and, and, this, is, and this is a big but. I need you to promise nothing bad will happen to Harley. They're setting up all these difficult Ready. choices. One criminal slip through the cracks every once in a while can't be the worst thing. Sorry, John, no exceptions. That gang, they're going to fall. <laughs> oh, they're going to fall. Man, that's so good. You're the real deal, you know that? Of course you know it. Now, when you're on the job, what's the preferred method of extracting a target? Always repelling in, or explosives as a distraction, or... You know what? I'll wing it. If I were you, I'd get a friend to help. That's a great idea! I hope Bruce is there. He'd do anything for me. Oh, one last thing! <laughs> I collect these. They mean a lot to me. What, what the? No pictures. Laptop behind the stack deck. Well, I hope you weren't counting on a specific time because, you know, that's what I use my phone for. Wait. Why? Why would I trust him for the laptop? As Batman, when he already said he's gonna get it for me when I was Bruce Wayne, that doesn't make any sense. You speak, but all I hear are lies. You dishonor yourself, Timothy. If you are the rat, then wear it proud. I would have respect for that, and with respect comes mercy. Greetings, Wayne. Come with me. As a fellow apostle of technology, I thought you might appreciate this. Bane and I were acquiring components for a device I'll need once we get to the black site. Device? Yes, an ice explosive for the fire failsafe we anticipate encountering. That isn't the impressive detail. As we ran into interference, I determined I would be more efficient if I made smaller versions and employed them as projectiles. Who were they? Hindrances. As you can see, it's been wildly successful. These people didn't need to die. There are other ways. Maybe you're better suited for the realm of business. The people you kill there are faceless. We live in a twisted world, Bruce. Better to abide than struggle against it in vain. One more time, my friend. Why did an alarm go off when it was your job to ensure it didn't? Bane, come on. I, I slipped up. Dangerous time to make a mistake when you knew I was looking for a mole. You're trying to slow us down. No, look, I want to get paid just like you. I got mouths to feed. Then, when the police arrived, you were nowhere to be found. I... You know I'm no traitor. I stood up for you, remember? Come on, man. We have to stand together on this. 
Yeah, sure. Pretty bold move. Good, yeah, yeah. Now, now why, why would I do that if I was dirty? I'd have thrown you to the walls to cover my ass, right? Oh, ho, ho, a deft turn. But it's not enough to save you. In fact, your awareness of how to deceive only creates more suspicion. What the hell is going no, on no, here? No, 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 no. Merely plugging the leak. God damn it, Bane. Do you run in your own investigation? You gonna get little business cards printed that say Detective Bane now? Hey, 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 hey. Hold on. Why are you complaining? I didn't get a chance to grill the guy. I'm a trained psychiatrist. What are you? A side of beef with a hunch? I'll find the rat, and I'll deal with it. You can't be trusted to run your men anymore. They're mine now. Got Yours? It? <laughs> I freed them from Santa Prisca. You just killed one. I only shot him. Who do you think wins that recruitment war? They won't follow you. What do you want, John? Right, the, the laptop. This seems like the perfect time. You don't know for sure it was him, so now what? They know the cost. I value loyalty above all else. You know who's going to have a tough time being loyal now? That guy. Just keep her busy. I have to sneak into her office to get it. Then uh, it's all yours. Yep. Getting it for my old buddy Bruce. And only you. Promise. Sound like a plan. Up top. Yes, that was a good one. Hey, you two. What's going on with you guys? Harley! What a surprise! You guys get me a black site location or not? The answer had better be yes, Harley. Sorry, we didn't have any luck. And how has Wayne disappointed you this time? What do you want? Shouldn't you be informing your men they work for me now? You? You can't even keep these two from colluding. Putin? Are you kidding me? He's loyal to a fault. I'm loyal, Harley. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Because I want to be. Because I'm being myself. The mole, Bane's men, you maybe, possibly, potentially can't handle it alone. <laughs> you have a problem, and I want to help. You, time out! And you, we need to talk. Holy crap, there's so much going on this episode. So much chaos. Bruce, Bruce, Bruce. This here's one of my favorite toys. Helps me make boring things into pretty things. Can you be a smart guy and guess another one of my favorite toys? Come on, you can do it. Is it John? Oh, look at that. There are some neurons firing in there after all. You two are getting a little too close for comfort. So I'm making a new rule. Hands off point is john's mine and mine alone so don't play with my toys or i'll bash in that pretty face of yours albert get a suit ready for drop off of course was your accomplice successful Apparently not. What happened? 
Catwoman got here first. Yeah, I don't even know what's going on anymore. It's just a race with a laptop and all bunch of a uh, whole bunch of weird stuff. Hey, I was hoping you'd catch up to me. I hadn't had a chance to thank you for tipping me off about the GCPD. I didn't expect it. You really saved my ass. If it wasn't for you, the cops would have gotten the drop on me for sure. You should have expected I would. I'd helped you before. And it surprises me every time. Now I need you to help me. The laptop. I need you to hand it over. You proved your point. Quite the coincidence that we find ourselves here again. What do you mean, again? We're on top of the mayor's old office. Harvey's old office. Feels like a hundred years ago, doesn't it? Since we had our first chase. Yeah, it does. That's the night I saved your life. First time I saw you. We had something then. Same as we do now. A give and a take. You want it? Take it. You didn't think it'd be that easy, did you? I needed that. Oh, come on. That was fun. I bring out that wild side of yours. The one you like to keep stuffed down in that suit. The side of you that's just aching to break free. Yeah, it's a little crazy. But isn't that what you like about me? We both like to live on the edge. It's where we find each other. Maybe it is. Maybe you're just my kind of crazy. And maybe you're mine. Well, have a good night. Selena. Why'd you do it? Run off at Riddler's like that? I wanted to get payback for Riddler. On my own terms. For what they did to him. For what he did to you. And just, what are you offering me in return? You're a man of many resources. Make me an offer I can't refuse. Okay, Selena. I'll give you what you want. And what is it you think I want? Something meaningful. With someone who has your back. I've had you already. But who knows? I might be up for a repeat performance. Just promise to work with me. I'll stop playing games. We've had our fun, haven't we? And it seemed like, for a moment at least, you wanted more than that. I came back to stop Harley's so-called pact. The Eddie I knew would have wanted that. Anything else? Us? That's just icing on the cake. No pressure. Really.
So, CP I'd nice. say it's time to find a black site, partner. We'll probably need our own supercomputer to get into his laptop. But something tells me you might know where to find one. Come home with me. What's at home? You'll see. I always feel like we're being watched now. Nothing feels safe anymore because we're dealing with the Joker. Baby Joker. I thought I'd seen it all when I found you hanging with the sewer rats, Bruce. This place. It's really you. Rich men and their toys. Only thing missing is a wet bar. The cave shields my tech from surveillance and gives me direct access to Gotham's waterways. It's perfect. <laughs> yeah, but it's so isolating. Like the whole world is just closed off. I know how hard it is to let people in. The fact that you've done that, it means a lot to me, Bruce. I didn't give a damn about anyone else until I met you. You're a bad influence on me. You say that like it's a bad thing. It definitely makes life more complicated. Being here, with you, I came back to Gotham for a little redemption, but I didn't expect to find it next to you. It's nice, the way I feel around you, like, like I can be better. Do you maybe feel the same? I'm gonna kiss you now. It's funny how they show a picture of Harvey in the back. That's right before that. Oh, I've missed this. Hold that thought. Is that what I think it is? What is my stuff doing on display in your cave? Alongside mementos of the psychopaths you've locked up? Not that you're normal, by any stretch of the imagination, but... Uh, and there I am. Right next to Harvey Dent. This has got to be good. It remind me of you. Is that such a bad thing? Uh, did you... want them back? Hold on to them. They look kind of nice there. Tea for two is served. Alfred, thank you. It does have the retinal scan, right? Detected. Accessing Sanctus Project Lotus files. Retinal scan required. Let's try this again. Access granted. Bruce, whenever you have a moment, I have something to show you. The back computer will scan for viruses and other safeguards before we can have access to the data. Nice car, right? Over 600 horsepower.
Selena. So, what do you think? There's a lot of interesting tech down here. How you did it all, I'll never know. And it's more hospitable than the abandoned subway those maniacs call home. But just barely. So, what do you think is next for us? Romantically or with Riddler's laptop? <laughs> I don't have a lot of expectations, but I do have some hope. Isn't this that dangerous one? And when did I bring back Riddler's cane, anyway? Oh, it's this again. I think this one is new. Joker poison. Oh, that was the one from the first game. So why don't we just tell Gordon that I'm Batman? Come on, just trust I him. I finished up a new feature for your contacts. Lucius nearly completed it before. But, well, I've been fiddling with it to keep myself occupied. Uh, at any rate, your contacts now have the capability to detect heat signatures. Cold, too, because, well, with Mr. Freeze, you never know. Thanks. I'm sure it'll come in handy. I'm impressed you felt close enough to someone to welcome them into the Batcave. But I'm curious to know why. What is it about her? Not that I'm judging, mind you. She's important to me. I thought as much. Good for you, Bruce. This is a big step. <sighs> it's done. Sounds like the laptop is safe. Isn't Harley gonna be mad though? Cause I'm pretty sure she noticed the laptop is gone and she's gonna go crazy about it. The episode should be ending very soon. It's been a very chaotic episode, very eventful, but nothing really too big revealed yet. I shall be upstairs if you need me. Only hints. Good luck. Look at all this data. Finally, something we can read. Let's see what he knew. Agency file. Patient 843. 10 milligram injection at 0.01% solution. <laughs> Patient 844. 10 milligram injection at 0.015% solution. God, what is that? Human test subjects? We have to find what they were giving those test subjects. Invoices, schematics, design notes. Probably some superpower serum or something. It's always like that.
Riddler must have been talking about the location of the black side. His obsession with data left us an incredibly thorough paper trail. Look at these manifests. Bodhi Spa. Strange place for a delivery of virus incubators. This must be what Riddler means by hiding in plain sight. from the looks of things. A biological weapon. This is what Harley wants. But why does the agency have it? Agency? The agency. Don't you work with them? Amanda Waller. She runs the agency. Sounds like you owe her a phone call. Bruce, to what do I owe the pleasure of this call? The agency was working on a virus, with human test subjects. Bruce, what on earth? I just saw it with my own eyes. How do you... is that what Quinn's after? Yes, I found the black site, hiding in the middle of Gotham, at the Bodhi Spa. Okay, okay. I promise we'll get to the bottom of this. But I need you to trust me. Meet me at Wayne Tower in 15. I'll tell you what I know. Harley was asking if the goggles are ready. I'll go back to the subway, see if I can keep her busy. Thanks, Selena. Ben oh, that's a bad idea. Partners. Be safe, Bats. You bad too. idea. Wait, why am I going as Bruce? Shouldn't I go as Batman? Or is it safer as Bruce, I guess? Tiffany, what are you doing here? Running late today? I expected you earlier. I needed to talk to you, but you only have yourself to blame for this. Hands behind your back! On the floor, now! On the floor! Now, now! Bruce Wayne, you're under arrest for armed robbery, murder, and criminal conspiracy to commit a terrorist act. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. Gordon, this is all one big mistake. Uh, shut your mouth and stay down! Uh, thanks for the call, Miss Fox. You've done a good thing today. Damn it, Gordon, I what are you doing? For answers for comfort after my father's death. Instead, you're running with a new crowd. Criminals? I hope you understand why I had to do this. It makes me question everything you've told me my entire life. Why didn't you just talk to me, Tiffany? I tried. Every time I saw you, you were with those freaks. What in the... Director Waller? Uncuff Mr. Wayne right now, or you'll spend the rest of your life as a meter maid. Mr. Wayne is under agency protection, and you know it. What? You've known it for some time. Waller and the agency, they're not always going to be around to save you, Wayne. One day, you're going to run out of favors to call in. I'm not a criminal, Gordon. Save Officers, it. please. He's involved. He belongs in a cell. This is neither your concern or your purview. Go home, Gordon. You're done here. The hell I will! If I were you, I'd be very careful with my next words. And if I were you, I'd stop interfering with GCPD business. This is my city! Not anymore. You're so far out of line, you can't see the truth. You're dismissed. Excuse me? You tested me. This is what happens. Damn it, Waller! You can't do this! It's well within my power, and you know it. Waller, Gordon is a good cop. He's a good man. Don't do this. Not from you. It's the last straw. I won't allow anyone to question my authority. This is strictly professional. Oh, sure. Time to go, Jim.
We'll make sure Gordon leaves and be right outside. When you're ready. I apologize for everything. Calling the cops was a bit much. Well, you wanted a chance to talk to me, so here it is. Talk. I just don't understand how you got tied up in all this. The agency? If I had known you were... What are you doing with them? Please, just tell me, Bruce. It's classified. I'm sorry, Tiff. I can't say. I guess I understand. Whatever this is. Whatever you're doing. I see now, though. This is why he's dead. He was involved in whatever you're doing. This work you're doing seems incredibly dangerous. But there's something I don't get. Why you? I mean, no offense, but you're just... Bruce. I'm Batman. You're Batman. The Batman. Come on. I've got something to show you. Hey, Bruce. Wanted to show you a preview of your new Batsuit. I know you and Alfred are still on your well-deserved retreat, but I couldn't help myself. Dad. I'll upload the specs to your private server. All right. Hope you guys are enjoying yourselves. I'll see you soon. It was hard to believe. But hearing it from him... Your dad was a hero. Your dad believed the city deserved better. He believed in me. And to think I gave him lip for missing dinner sometimes. With Dad gone... Maybe I can still help. If Batman is interested. It's the least I can do. The way things are going right now... He could use a little help. Okay. I need to... Digest. Sorry for everything earlier. But... Thank you for trusting me with this. I'm only saying we might be pushing him too hard. He's capable, and he knows how to cover his tracks. Our only path forward is through Wayne. <clears throat> oh, let's get to it, then. I know you have some questions. A few. Care to explain why the videos I saw said this virus was an agency experiment? Years ago, I was brought in to rectify the agency's past mistakes. Or, failing that, to cover them up. One mess in particular dealt with black ops experiments. Human subjects. The kind of amoral science that makes your skin crawl. Sanctus. They were a division that was shut down for good, long before either of us joined. But evidently, they went underground. This is our worst case scenario. With Sanctus off the leash, this research poses a global threat. If I'd known where they set up their den, I would have taken them out years ago. If you want them taken out, now's your chance. We know right where they are. It's not that simple. Sanctus was dangerous then. They're certainly worse now. This whole situation, it's given me an idea. I can't put an agent within a thousand yards of that place without them starting a war or blowing up the entire block just to cover their tracks. We know it's tricky, but leaving Harley and her gang into Sanctus might allow the two problems to take care of themselves. They have Riddler's info. They have a way in. And you're undercover with them. At least with Sanctus and the pack at each other's throats, the agency can act quickly, clean up, and minimize casualties. It's unorthodox, but a strike like this will keep damage from spilling onto Gotham streets. You two can't be serious. Harley, Bane, Freeze? No, they can't be trusted. We don't have to trust them. We trust you. Look, for now, just go and check this place out. Right now, as yourself. We don't want them to know Batman is on their tail. 
I bet you're the type of guy who has some expensive surveillance equipment. We have your back, Bruce. We'll be right behind you. Keep me in the loop so I know what my team and I might be facing when it goes down. Defenses, security, whatever. Their lives are in your hands, Bruce. As well as the fate of this city. Okay, now there's some stuff going on. I know you on. might have reservations about working with Harley and her crew like this. But sometimes you have to use bad people to do good things. Damn, I feel bad about Gordon, though. He's just trying to do his job, but he's he's being misled. Because I can't tell him I'm Batman, apparently. Al? Have you located the black site? I think so. While you were at the office, I did some basic online research on the Bodhi Spa. Excellent. What's the verdict? According to reviews, it truly seems to be a fully functioning business. Uh, not just a front. Couldn't tell from the service entrance. They offer rather popular high-end massages and have an active social media feed. It's a 24-hour business, Bruce. There are customers going in and out at all times. They have no idea what's coming for them. It's possible they're in on it. Uh, you may be right, but there's no way to tell until you get in there. Initiate the feed of my contacts to Waller. Let her know I'm here. At once. We need to see what we're up against. Good idea. Remember, you're able to toggle the thermal imaging in your lenses. I'm signing off while you speak with Director Waller. Be careful. Thanks, so. Al. Waller? On the line, Bruce. I'm here. I'll let you know if I find anything interesting. Caution is key, Bruce. This situation is a spark away from a wildfire. I'll keep that in mind. Oh, it's so cool. So I can change my contacts. What is ice? Ice is for cold stuff. Seems to be some kind of sewer entrance or something there, maybe? Wait, ice is thermal. Electric is... Oh, electric is something else. That appears to just be a patron. There are still traces of heat signatures. Someone was here recently. Maybe guards. I see a security panel inside the building. Oh, it's for it electricity. An alarm I see. system of some kind. If I can hit that before they suspect what I'm really here for, they'll be blind and helpless. Perfect for my people. You just saved a few agents' lives, Bruce. Is that also a security panel, I guess? What is this? Oh, it's, wait. Oh, what the? Why is that guy there? lab must be underground. Sanctus has been in the middle of Gotham this entire time. They burrow under your skin and eat you from the inside out. This is why I'm willing to let these criminals be the tip of the spear. Dangerous and expendable. My favorite adjectives. Some heat pipes. Looks like we have a receptionist behind the front desk. She's hardly anything to worry about. All too easy to hide a gun under that desk. Is that it? 
Anything else? That access door is connected to the spa. That's some top-notch field work, Bruce. I know being undercover has been tough, but you just need to maintain it a little longer. If you don't get inside with those maniacs, we're going to have a pandemic on our hands. Waller, I need to go. Now, why would a billionaire be skulking around in a filthy alley? Carefully inspecting every detail. Almost as if performing reconnaissance. I could ask you the same. Oh, I'm not skulking. I have a very deliberate purpose. What Bane, have you been spying on me? Spying? No. I've only been keeping an eye on you. That's the same thing. I heard the GCPD paid you a visit at your office. So I swung by to see if you might be in need of some aid. Innocent as that. Then, something about the look on your face as you left. So, determined. Yes, I had a sense you would lead me to something interesting. Project Lotus. Isn't that what John told me you found at Riddler's? The bit you and Harley tried to omit? I thought I'd have to break something to get it from him. But I think our friend likes to play both sides. Where are we, Bruce? What is this place? And do your best, to be honest. This is it. The black site Riddler wanted to hit. So this is what Harley was trying to keep secret. She didn't know. <laughs> Strange that you're here after a run-in with GCPD in an alleyway with the other rats. Finding you in this duplicitous position while we have a mole problem. Well, it does not look good for you, my friend. When you wake up, you can tell Harley that you led me right to her conspiracy. Wake up. Well, that was a uh, nice shine. Ow. Early. Hold your horses. Oh, I pity what you're about to face, Wayne. You did the right thing telling me about the black site but there's still something about you that gives me pause something that casts a shadow over your heart Harley wanted to spearhead the hunt for the mole this will be her chance so be thoughtful with your words in there they could be your last thanks for the warning I'll be careful I hope it's not you, Wayne. But if it is, I'll kill everyone who shows up for your funeral. What is it now, Bane? The rat has been uncovered. Wayne was right under your nose. I tracked Wayne to the location of the black site. And if he had I sent Wayne to scout it, so lower your damn voice. It was the final piece of the puzzle, and now we got it. Go get your boys ready. We move on the site ASAP. And don't worry your pretty little head about our rat problem. I got it covered. And Bane, tell Freeze to get one of them popsicle makers ready. You're not going anywhere. You're in here. With me. Damn. This episode's still going on? It's pretty exciting. It might be the best one yet, who knows. Oh, that's creepy. Thanks for backing me up. Don't mention it. Can't have him stepping on my turf, you know? I said I'd find the rats. And I will. Your father. He was a hard man, right? Someone lied to him. 
betrayed him, he ended them. Think he was onto something with that idea? Show no mercy? Take no apologies? That sort of thing? There's always another way. Killing someone isn't an answer. The son of Thomas Wayne shies away from spilling blood. You are who I think you are, Bruce. Who do you think I am? A man out to prove to the underworld he's just as bad as his dear departed dad. Or there are more to the story I should know. Hidden depths? Secrets you don't want me to see? I also enjoy long walks on the beach. Hmm. <laughs> You're funny. Must have gotten that from your mother's side. You know my dad could be a funny guy too. deep to drown to the dark to drown he used to sing that to me my dad made me feel safe like nothing could hurt me i can tell he meant a lot to you he did till he blew his brains out now he's just a glimmer in a maggot's belly same as we'll all be someday in fact, you being like my dad, that's why I got such a soft spot for you. Oh, you do? You found me the black site, didn't you? Plus, you're not a bad guy. I mean, you're rotten like the rest of us. But you actually care for some people. Like that girl. What's her face? Uh, Brittany? No. Tiffany. You remember? Early 20s. Fresh-faced and optimistic. Are you threatening her? Oh, take it down a notch, Wayne. Your friend is safe. It's your job to keep her that way. Yeah, friends are great. Except when you have to lose them. Laptop's gone. What are you... Yeah, shocker. We have a turncoat. I've interviewed just about everyone in the place. Except maybe one. Or two. So gosh, that only leaves the two people I haven't cleared. You and Catwoman. Maybe it was the guy who Bane gave the hamburger face. But weirdest thing, the laptop went missing after that. Well, you seem to have made up your mind already. I guess one of us has to be the mole. But you've already cleared me. Trying to make me second-guess myself ain't gonna work, sweetie. Nice try, though. John, get in here! When I told Puddin I narrowed it down to you two, he begged me to let him interrogate you. I gave him some pointers, and now this is his chance. Hi, Bruce. You potential rat. Have at it, John. Harley, do you mind? Can't learn to ride with training wheels on forever, you know? I'll be right outside. Admit it, you rat scum! You're the... the rat! <laughs> Sorry, I have to make it sound good. It's okay, it's okay. You have to keep it up. Right, right, right. Thanks. You're getting him already. Huh. I'll let it play. <sighs> I never wanted it to come to this. But we both know what has to be done. Catwoman has to take the fall. Think about it, Bruce. Harley's gonna kill that Tiffany girl if it's you. Okay, John. That's what we'll do. Really? I knew you'd see reason. But she is the one who stole it. It's not us. Fast. Okay, okay, okay. This is good. I'm calling her back in. Harley, we're done. Puddin, you might have surpassed the teacher. That was record time. Who are we hanging out to dry? Go ahead, Bruce. Tell her what you told me. Come on. 
Go ahead, Bruce. It's okay. It was Catwoman. She took your laptop. How do you know? Uh, sh she took a phone call at Riddler's. Bruce overheard her talking about it. I understand, Bruce. I'm disappointed, too. So much for the solidarity of sisterhood. <laughs> and here I was, starting to be a cat person. I knew you had it in you, John. We are gonna do terrible things together. Like skin a cat. Oh, they actually got her? How did they get her? Did you think I was just gonna let her go or something? That freaking chance. She's gonna get turned into one of Freeze's popsicles. I know cats don't like water, but how do they feel about ice? <laughs> don't I love her? We're ready to move. Guards, this'll just take a second. Get her inside. Wait, is she actually gonna die? No way. <laughs> I've seen that look in your eyes before on other men just before they get themselves killed. How many lives is she down to? Damn. That's rough. Holy crap. I was just joking when I said that she'd probably die, but holy crap. She might actually die. I feel bad for Gordon, though. Huh. <laughs> Less skeptical. That's pretty funny. No! Well, I guess we're going down the John route, rip. I think Tiffany is probably one of the harder ones to convince. Because if you lie to her at first, I'm pretty sure she finds out that you're lying about a, a lot of things. But if you tell her the truth, she gets upset and then does what she did in the previous episodes. But I guess she's easy to convince. Damn. That's a tough one. I said this last time, or I said this during the first, uh, the first series, the first season. Catwoman can handle herself, but this is a crazy one. This is not as bad as before. Preview? No preview, of course. Typical. Okay, I want the next episode now. That was intense. Slow, but intense. Fun. <laughs>